So this is part of the routine, um, you know, something that I have to deal with that I've been dealing with for the last 12 years is this, this sleep deprivation and uh, invasion of space and privacy. Uh, like I said, you know, this guy knew that what he was doing was illegal. He knows his stalking, but yet they're so bold about it. They know that I'm recording. And they're bold about it because they know the police are cooperating. They know the police are the ones who are soliciting them to, to get involved. So they're giving them this false sense of, of um, bravery and courage, you know, telling them that, oh, you know, you're, you're going to be immune to this. You know, as far as you know, getting any type of criminal charges. Um, but I'd rather be sleeping right now. I'm exhausted, but I have to be alert and I have to be awake. You know, monitoring these things and watching these things, because I'm constantly being monitored and watched by police, potential rapists, potential rapists, and this is why they're out doing what they're doing right tonight. They're out seeking me out for rape. I mean, can you can you fathom? Can you imagine? This is every night, every single night. If I were to record every single night that I'm being harassed, chased, and stalked for the purposes of them bringing bodily harm to me, I wouldn't have any storage. I'm a citizen, unfortunately, of these lands, and I'm being chased around like I'm being hunted in the Serengeti somewhere for rape by people who are supposed to be civilized, by men who are supposed to be civilized. Let that sink in. Because I feel like people are just immune and numb when I say and when I talk about what, what I'm going through. This is not a normal thing. This is not some small, oh, you know, really good luck, keep your head up type of shit. I'm being violated, unwarranted. As if you could actually have a warrant to have this kind of treatment. But... I haven't done anything. I haven't put myself in any bad or unsavory situations for me to be getting this kind of treatment. But I'm sitting here, sitting up, trying to watch my post so that I'm not going to be bodily harmed and violated by individuals who are supposed to be a part of society and a community. And nothing's done. Not even by those who watch. Not even by those who see. There's something wrong. There's something deeply, deeply wrong. When you can hear someone tell you that this is what's happening to them. And your only response is stay strong. There's something wrong.